Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Dayton, Ohio, and Monday Night Raw. Michael Cole and Jerry the King Lawler here at ringside. And just 24 hours ago at the Royal Rumble, Big Show and Cody Rhodes' startling actions allowed the world's largest athlete to capture the World Heavyweight Championship. Well, you know, ordinarily, I wouldn't take anything from Big Show. I mean, he's been champion a bunch of times. But let's face it, Big Show showed his true colors last night when he turned his back on the WWE. And now it looks like we're going to hear from these turncoats. Look who's turned on WWE. Shocking, Big Show. Absolutely shocking. Why would you do such a thing? Well, my dashing friend, I love WWE. I've competed here for over 10 years. The thing is, a man of my stature loves two things even more. Money and power. So, when Kevin Nash approached me and reminded me of the bankroll I made the NWO, I mean, from a business standpoint, this was the only decision. And as for me, this is without a doubt the most lucrative move I've ever made. You see, I actually got a call from Arn Anderson, who tried to convince me to join this group because of my family ties to WCW. My father, Dusty Rhodes, was one of the greatest competitors that ever stepped foot in a WCW ring. I'm proud of my dad's legacy. And then, Big Kev came at me with a few sacks of cash to seal the deal. was that.
He's looking at it again. RKO, the fight for strikes. No, oh no, Orton, Orton. Uh, Orton's finally punted one of these legends back to the 80s. <clears throat> oh, God, grief. Big show like a locomotive just drove Orton right through the stairs. Oh, and Randy Orton isn't moving. <laughs> 